Hi guys, this is Emily Cupelli again. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Saturday. This is how my spread is looking so far. And I'll be decorating the first week of June. For which I already started with my washi tape from Recollections from Michaels. And as you can see here, it has some beautiful gold foiling. And it is another one of their like continuous pattern washi tape that you can stack and get a continuous pattern and I added it to a piece of label paper like a sticker paper not sure if I'll end up using this but I still wanted to show you guys in case you were wondering and after that I will take this other narrow washi tape from Recollections as well and we'll add it to the top line of my boxes and this came in a set of five where I got this hot pink one along with like a navy blue or just a dark blue and then some florally ones which I used a lot in my spring spreads and then on the bottom of my pages I will add another Recollections washi tape, which is this one, which is a pink one with the cold foil flamingos. But first I will wait out this deco that we have in our Happy Planner because it shows through a little bit and I don't want it showing through the washi tape. And then I'll just add the washi tape on top of the wait out. And then for my quote sticker or my quote corner, I will use this sticker in here from the watercolor sticker book. And it reads, start where you are, use what you have, do what you can. So I think that is a nice motivational quote for this week or any week really. And just because this washi tape goes really well with the colors of this of the stickers I'm gonna be using today, let's also use it today because this is a color that I do not use that often. So who knows when else will I be able to use it, right? And I'll use it almost like a header or a divider or something like that. And even though this will be a pretty summary spread and stickers, still, as you can see, I will have some flowers here and there. So I will use this checklist from my seasonal sticker book, but I'll actually use the pink one because I want this spread to be like mainly pink or at least that is the plan. So I will use as much pink as I could even though as you can see I want to also incorporate the rest of the colors from the stickers but still I want to pull into the spread some more of the pinks and that will be for my dinners because I usually cook on the weekend and then I cook more that I will eat and I save it for the week and I like how it turned out in here where I used a gold metallic gel pen from Sakura um, to mark the meals as the, go as the days goes on because I plan to, okay, I will eat this on Monday, this on Tuesday, this on Wednesday but at the end sometimes I switch the meals and I am like, well, I'm actually in the mood for the pizza on Tuesday and I don't want to eat something just because I planned on it if I want to switch them, I want to be able to switch them, right? So this way I keep track of what I have left, but I don't have them like specifically for each day, if that makes any sense. And also I mark them with a little dot that kind of completes the flower and is a way for me to check the things 
in my checklist but it's still making it look pretty I think and then from my rose gold sticker pack from her collections I will use this Mills icon to mark that and this is the Memorial Day weekend so there are great discounts on Michaels and I got a couple of stickers like this one and I got it for just like 160 I believe because it was 50% off and then I was able to use a coupon code for an extra 20% off and it has these four designs and it has two sheets of each design so I am kind of regretting not grabbing two packs of it because these icons I feel will be so useful for me and the price again was like crazy affordable in my opinion and then I will take this from recollections as well and it has some beautiful gold foiling and goes with the washi tape since it is like the same collection and the same theme and I will use it to mark the memorial day on Monday and like I was saying I got that at Michael's on actually today is Sunday today is not Saturday today is Sunday I usually film on Saturday so that is why before I said today is Saturday but actually it's Sunday already and I went on yesterday yesterday that was Saturday to Michael's and I got that sticker pack and I also got the I think the memory planning sticker book from Mambia My Big Ideas because sadly in my Michaels they always take forever to put the new stuff in stock so they didn't have any of the new stuff yet but I am happy at least I got to get something for a great price and this was from the basics sticker book from Mambi and then that sticker is from Mambi as well from the basic sticker book also and then on the other half of the week I want to mark down a few things but first I will start with another sticker from the basics sticker book which is this one and I want to use it because I do not get to use yellow too often and again my stickers today have some yellow so let's get some use out of it and after going to Michael's, I also went to Hobby Lobby where I got this awesome duo of washi tapes. As you know, I am like obsessed with washi tape. So when I saw this one at my local Hobby Lobby, I just had to grab it. And because I just cannot wait to use it, I will place it right by the other banner, by the weekend banner. But this time I will place it on Friday because it's Friday, it's payday, you don't really need more than that to celebrate, right? With some beautiful gold foiling tassels. So that is what I'm gonna do here. This would have been really nice also on Monday because even though we want to get as many sales and discounts and offers on Memorial Day as we possibly could because that is just another chance to get all of that great deals still Memorial Day is actually about remembering our fallen heroes those who gave everything they had for us for our freedom and they definitely deserve to be remembered so that's always very important to remember the real meaning of Memorial Day. And right now I feel like that looks a little weird right by that other banner. So I'm gonna remove it from here. Um, instead I will put it here in the box in the middle. It's still on Friday, it's still celebrating Friday, it's still celebrating payday, it's still celebrating the beginning of the weekend. But, you know, like, even out things a little more. And from Hobby Lobby, I also got 
this is super cool and cute and pretty this sticker book it is like a budget sticker book from paper house but it has a lot of really cool stickers it has lots of payday it has this checklist that even though if you do not do budget i thought i could use them to write down for example cut them to the size i need and put down uh, like the places you went or you bought something from even if you do not want to put the amount you spent um, still it would be like a fun way to mark that down and today I just cannot wait to use these super adorable piggy banks so I, I will use that one along with the payday little circle and will layer them together and since I put the banner, the tassels banner, here in the box in the middle. I guess I will just sit the little pig here in the middle line of my boxes. And then we'll do something similar with these build you and house stickers, where I will layer them and I will stick them on the first of the month remember to pay the rent I will actually layer them but like side by side to take up a little more space and we'll use my exacto knife because that way it's like easier to put them down and then from my sticker stickers paws I will take one of those which are clear stickers and I will stick them down in one of my little labels from recollections to mark down that I have to give the heart peel to my doggy. And then for the videos of this week, I want to use these teardrops. And because both of my spreads and my plan with me are gonna be like summery spreads, I think these are just perfect to mark down that. And they are gold foiling, so really pretty. And now I will mark down the laundry day, which because on Monday I do not have to work, I have the day off, I will mark that down on Monday, to do on Monday. And for that I will take this label from my recollections sticker sheet, along with my shock inks which I got at Joanne, and my stamp set from recollections from Michaels. And I will stamp directly in the label, so wish me luck. <laughs> But I will stamp the little icon, the little washing machine, and then we'll just write down laundry. And with these inks, you have to be careful because it takes a little bit to dry. So don't smear it. And I feel like using a piece of this washi tape again, just because I love it and I just cannot wait to use it again. So let's put it on Memorial Day. And it looks like if I were celebrating laundry, but I guess it will just motivate me a little more with my laundry, hopefully. And now before getting fully into my deco stickers, I will add another strip of this like mustardy yellow washi tape. Not sure if I mentioned it, but this is from Hobby Lobby. And we'll add it in here for some deco stickers to give them some ground. And of course, I forgot to plan my next Saturday where I will probably be filming and because I already used this checklist in my spread 
I'll go ahead and use them again in here. And since I got a little bit of the orange in here and even in here, I will use this orange header also from the seasonal sticker book. I will use it for my checklist since those will be some to do's regarding my videos. And then I want to use this pink and yellow stickers sticker from Nikki Plus 3 along with one of these planner stickers from the Coffee Monster Co. And I will layer them together and we'll put them in here as part of my to-dos for my planning and my video. And then on Sunday I am planning on posting or more like on editing the very last video I have left from my March and April spreads that I am posting. So I had this label already written and everything but the day I put this down, I never got to edit a plan with me that day, so I simply removed it and saved it to use it another time, so that is why I am using it now. And now I want to get some use again from my yellow stickers and stuff that otherwise I don't usually use. So I want to use one of these beautiful paper clips from Nikki Plus 3 as well and because this is like a piece of paper I feel like those paper clips go perfect with those and as you may imagine I just cannot wait to use my memory planning sticker book from Mambi that I got on yesterday and I am planning on using it just as you know like in my regular planner not so much as memory planning because I feel like this you can make them work for your memory planning but also for your regular planning and this is meant for the big uh, happy planner but again you can make them work for whatever planner you may have and my weekends are when I really really enjoy my coffee time because on the week I always drink coffee as you may imagine but the weekends are like when I get to sit down and just enjoy it not just drink it because otherwise I wouldn't survive, survive the day but more because I like it and I just sit down with my cup of coffee and watch a plan with me or two and I really enjoy my coffee time on the weekends, so I will use that there. And now I can finally get to my deco stickers, which are gonna be these cardstock stickers from Dur Doodle Bug Design. And these are the Fun in the Sun cardstock stickers, which I got at scrapbook.com. And I will have the link to the web page in the description box of this video. And these are really, really pretty, really summery, but very sweet and pretty, I think. So I am really excited to be using this today. And one of the reasons why I pushed the quote box all the way to the top of the sidebar, covering the little calendar, which I usually do not use, is because I wanted to use some of these stickers here in the sidebar and they are fairly big and tall so I wanted some more space for those and of course these are again fairly big so I will not be able to use them all in my spread I will probably have a lot of leftovers but I want to make sure to use the ones that I like the most and as you can see I still have the nails that I had in one of my last weekly spreads no they haven't lasted this long like i mentioned these are like the temporary nails that you stick with just like a tape and they are from walmart although the first ones i used 
that are the ones that you already saw in another video they did last like five days much longer than i would ever expect them to last still after that they fell off or, or actually i like ended up pulling them off because they were not falling off really only one of them got really loose so i decided to take them all off but they did last again like five days which is more than i was expecting them to last so i was pretty happy with them and out of one litter box i managed to get two full sets so i pulled those off and then i used the leftovers for another full set of nails so that was pretty cool And I was pretty much done with my spread when I remembered I wanted to use this shirt from my new memory sticker book. So because this watching machine is so light anyway, I will do that. But first I will quickly cover that up with a piece of my label paper. Because even though it is very light, this shirt is clear. So you can probably see a bit of the watching machine and then I will stick it on top to make my laundry day even more fun as fun as a laundry day can get and now I like that even more and here is a quick look at my full spread and now a quick close-up showcasing all the beautiful gold foiling remember that I always Put pictures of my finished spread at the end of the video so make sure to stay tuned if you want to see those pictures and I absolutely love how this turned out honestly I like it much more than I was expecting I love how I did the placement of all my deco stickers and I absolutely love the colors I feel this screams summer but still keeping a lot of those pinks that I love so much and I really really hope you like it too as much as I do please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up I truly truly appreciate it and thank you so much for all your sweet comments and for watching and until next time take care bye